Hey guys, what's up? This is 8-Bit Eric. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, I asked for some questions to answer. So without further ado, without any further ado, let's begin. Paul Collins asks, what's your opinion on the Wii not allowing to play Blu-rays or DVD? I'm assuming you mean the Wii U. I really don't care about it. Um, I mean, it would be nice if it could play Blu-rays or DVDs, but if it keep the cost down a little bit, then you know, I don't mind it. I play my consoles to play games. You know, I don't really focus on using it for DVDs or Blu-rays. And every time that I've used a console for that purpose, it's always gotten damaged. So yeah, I'm happy with my console just playing games. I don't need to watch movies on it. That's what Netflix is for, but I have a separate Blu-ray player and DVD player. Next question. Lorenzo Vuliger, I'm going to butcher your name. He asked, what's the best video game moment you've ever had? The best video game moment I've ever had probably was when I beat Ocarina of Time. I spent so long playing that game and it was one of my most awaited games of all time. I just was excited that I was finally beating it. It was like a huge achievement in my video game life. I guess it was an epic story, epic game, epic levels, lots of exploration, and finally the adventure was finishing. And it was it was a moment in time that resonates with me to this day. Next question. Richie Collins asks, "Are you and Scott Zyntek best friends?" Now, if you don't know who Scott is, he's Grimsy42. He was on the episodes of Game Chasers in Canada with me, and we had a little bit of a conflict that translated as negative on the episodes, and a lot of that was a little real. I mean, he did get on my nerves. He was talking a lot of crap, and you know, I just wasn't having it. Uh, since then, we have kind of, you know, I guess gelled into a love-hate relationship. Scott's a very cool guy. If you haven't seen his channel, you know, I'll leave the comment below. Um, he does pickups and talks about games that he's bought. He's doing a quest for NES games. He's pretty darn close to getting all the NES library. And, um, I mean, we've kind of grown into a friendship, even though he was a little bit of a douche. Next question! Eric Duarte, also known as Chuckles, asked, Do you think the Wii U is going down and it has nowhere to go but up? I do not think the Wii U is going down at all right now. I think that this fall is going to kick so much ass with the Wii U. You got Smash Brothers coming out. You got all sorts of games being announced. New 3DS. You got um, Bayonetta 2 coming out. You got Hyrule Warriors. You got lots of news on the upcoming Zelda game. Wii U has only up to go. I mean, yeah, it's probably never going to be the number one console of this generation, but uh, who cares? Why has it got to be about that? The games are probably the best video game library out of the three. The Wii U has the best library. Bottoms down. Most variety, most number of games. They're cheap, they're affordable, a lot of them are fun. The independent games that are available for download are also fun, and I think it's just overall a excellent underrated system. You know, people talk about the Dreamcast being uh, underrated and ahead of its time. I think the Wii U was the same way. Do I see Nintendo going away? No, I do not. They will be around next generation, that is for sure.